talk about your hotspots. Pineapple Willies is basically the quintessential Panama City Beach hotspot. They've got the deck right on the beach. They're open for lunch and dinner. They've got great drinks. And to be honest with you, there's so much to do and see here that we can't really spend much time in just one place. Obviously, we're on the beach right now, which is one of the huge aspects of Pineapple Willies. But there is so much other stuff. So we're going to take a huge tour, let you see all the individual parts of Pineapple Willies that make it unique. Unique to Panama City Beach. Check it out with me. Okay, this is Eric, one of the owners of Pineapple Willies. Now, this is like right where the action happens. I feel like we're about to get trampled by some servers here. Right, we're moving them fast. Right here, we're in the rib station. This is what we're famous for, the barbecue ribs. I know, so people come from literally all over the place just for Pineapple Willies barbecue ribs. And this is like a pretty intense process over here. It, they fall right off the bones, and they're mm, so good. <laughs> How many wet naps do you need after you have these ribs? We do go through a lot. We customize them, actually, down here. Awesome. Well, this is, of course, what they're absolutely famous for. These ribs are fantastic, along with all the other food that they have back here. And uh, this is an eye-opening experience. This is the coolest thing I think I've seen in a long time. Let's see how they do it right here. Okay, so Eric, we're in the kitchen. We saw all those ribs being made, packaged up, brought out to tables. I'm starving. It's delicious, and we have some right here, so let's have some. Okay, we're going to try these world-famous barbecue ribs at Pineapple Willies. All right, ready? Okay, this is AJ, and he's actually from Alabama. Now, AJ, you traveled how far for these ribs? At least 150 miles to come down here and eat these ribs. This is a main attraction. We come down here every year to come here and eat these ribs. Okay, well, Eric has been a very gracious host so far. We had some delicious ribs, which, by the way, I'm so full now. Those were delicious. Thank you. And this is the place to come out and party also after dinner. You don't have to go far. It's right next door. It's Pineapple Willie's Pier Bar. And here we are. And uh, what a great atmosphere. I mean, you've got uh, live music. You've got just a nice laid-back atmosphere. And, of course, these drinks. What do we have here? This is a 190 octane. It's our number one drink around here. It's kind of secret what's in it, but it'll really get your engine revved up. All right, here we go. Hang on. Whoa, that has a kick to it. <laughs> I like it. I like it. And I'll tell you what, it's heavy too. So I mean, this is the drink that everybody gets when they when they come here. Yeah. It's three drinks in one, so you'll have to harass the bartender a lot. <laughs> Very good. And this is obviously uh, a huge drink. Some you can enjoy here while you're watching some live music. This is uh, the best place to come if you're looking for a drink. All right. The other thing that Pineapple Willies is absolutely known for is live music, right? Right. March to October, we're running live music up here at Pineapple Willies. So now after you've got dinner with the ribs, you've got some great drinks, you're going to enjoy some great music uh, like we are right now, right? Right. All right. Let's check them out. It's a great place to eat dinner, so delicious. Also a great place for drinks and live music, too. It's fantastic. It's got a lot of history. It's the place you've been looking for.